Hi, welcome to my smart home Sunday. I don't have that much to show today, but I have been tinkering again with Home Assistant and to tell you the truth, I'm lost. Here's what I'm trying to do. I have Philips Hue light system installed at home. I'm controlling it with Home Assistant and I wanna set up circadian lighting in the house, right? So that allows the body to follow a more circadian rhythm and it can be influenced by the type, brightness, color of light that you use throughout the day. Now, at the moment, we've been manually adjusting this and it does seem to feel like it gives a different feeling to the, the body and the sleep, even though maybe sometimes I don't sleep. Anyway, uh, it does give a difference to energy levels in the morning and the afternoon. So I'll be trying to figure out Home Assistant, there's got to be something there I can do to control the circadian light levels. So then I began searching and then the confusion started. First off, I found this flux add-on. Looked fairly simple, but actually that's part of the problem. It looked like it's just start point, end point and change the temperature change the color it seemed a little bit simple i want to try and do something a little bit more advanced then i came across the circadian lighting component i mean that's what i want look at that picture i mean that's fantastic um this is a very popular component and as I started to read through the discussion and all the details in the community that people have been talking about with this component, it looks great. Lots of people are using it, it looks pretty robust. But then I started to find a few comments where people are saying, oh, I've done a new version. The new version. New adaptive lighting integration. So this one is based on the last one I just showed you, but this is a candidate to be integrated into Home Assistant. So who knows, maybe in the near future, Home Assistant will just ship with this installed. So you'll just go turn the feature on and then everything will just magically work. Maybe, maybe. But again, reading through the discussion, of course, there's another solution. I don't know what to call this one. I'm gonna call it the artistic model clearly is the artistic model. Now, this person's actually talking about the fact that, well, the light doesn't just go from blue through to a warm red. It actually changes multiple times during the day and also the brightness of the light needs to change. So this person was looking at building their own solution to take those things into account. Now, I have to say this looks pretty and <laughs> it looks really interesting. So what am I gonna do? I don't know. Write some suggestions down below if you've got any, but I think I'll have a look at this last one during the week and let's see where I get to this time next Sunday. So I'll have more to share then. Thanks for stopping by. Bye for now.